Hi all, welcome to Salesforce in 5 minutes. In this video, we are going to understand very basics of accordion in LWC. But before getting started, if you like my videos, I request you to please subscribe to this channel. So in this video, we are going to go with very much basics of accordion, very basics. If you already know accordion, how it works and when it is used, I request you to skip this video because it's not much more for you. But it is a very basic video and if you do not know anything about accordion, what it is, when, when should we use it or, or anything like that, uh, you must watch this video then. So when do we, when do we use, first of all, what is accordion? Okay. So accordion is, let's say if you want to show the data in the form of such format, right? For an example, test one, right? And test two and test three, right? And as soon as user is going to click on this drop down. Okay, as soon as you go, is you going to click on this drop down, automatically you should show another data, new data, something like that. As soon as he clicks on, that's why I'm showing it in the form of V. But if he clicks on the drop down, you have to show another data. If he again clicks on this drop down, you need to show, uh, let's say, another data. Right? In that case, is this is how accordion actually looks like. Now, when exactly do we use accordion? So let's say I have very priority top five priority cases or let's say I have five accounts okay let's say account one account two account three right so whenever a user is going to click on this account one let's say user is going to click on one account one I want to see all the related contacts to it right contact one contact two contact three Again, the same goes for this one. Con4, Con5, Con6, and vice versa. And again, if user clicks on this contact, if you want to see all the related, let's say any test object named as test1, and uh, again, related to this is test2, or something like that right you have to go inner and inner like if you want to show all the data in a one picture itself right i want to see account and uh, the contact related to it and contact having test of uh, the test records which are related to that particular contact i have to see all the pictures in one go right i have to see all the picture in one go which record is related to what in one go itself in that case is we basically use accordion in lwc or in salesforce so how exactly do we do uh, we use it? It's pretty easy if we go to the uh, I have one child component already available and if you see the child component is embedded inside the home page. Now I'm going to just create an accordion over here. A very basic accordion. Right. Lightning. Yeah. Accordion. So it's all al it's already providing the sections. I'm going to remove this for now. Okay, so uh, my accordion is all, uh, automatically created. Okay, so what's happening is this is in completely accordion sections. Inside this sections, I have provided mini sections, right? So one would be accordion title A, something like this. It will be looking something like accordion title A, and inside this title A, I'm just showing this simple paragraph, right? Inside this accordion title A, I'm just showing this simple paragraph. Same goes for accordion title B, uh, the another one, right? Accordion title B, it's showing accordion title B the same way, okay? And it's showing the simple paragraph and say, vice versa. So if I go to this LWC component, if I refresh it, the home page of my Salesforce, I will be able to see the accordion. So as you can see, there's an accordion title A that was, this is this accordion title A and the paragraph that is inserted inside it, right? So this is a this is the content area for section A. Same way for title B and same way for title C. But this is how you basically basically create a, a simple structure of accordion. Let's say if you want to add more inner accordions to it, right? So what you can do is you, check, you can just copy paste copy this, remove this paragraph, and I'm going to add one more accordion. So what's going to happen is I'm going to name it as inner. Okay. So inside this basic accordion title A, inside this accordion, as soon as I'll open it, I'll find one more accordion. And if I click on that, after that, I'll be able to send, find this paragraph. So if you see, I have one accordion, 
if i click on this i will see one more accordion and once i click on this i will be able to see this paragraph so you can this way you can go more inner and inner inside the accordion so as you can see there's an accordion title a if i click on this there is an accordion title a inner and inside this you have certain data also you can go uh, more inner if you want to for an example if i go one more level let's see how it goes Very fresh it. So if you see, there's an according title A, inside title A, there is one more title A, and there's one more inner A and inner two. So this is how you can go more inner and inner inside the accordion in LWC. In the next video, what we are going to do is we are going to bring the data from Apex and show it inside the accordion in LWC. So this was a very basic structure and this is how uh, this this is basically a very basic structure how accordion looks like and how you can code for accordion in the next video mostly we'll bring the data from apex we will loop over this data and we'll show it inside the accordion so if you like this video i request you to please subscribe to this channel